following line. They're off. Rugelach came out well, tickled my fancy, and on the outside, Ropers and Wranglers now sent along to grab the lead, and Ropers and Wranglers will set the pace. And then it's tickled my fancy, head and head with Rugelach, right behind second and third. Five and a half back to Dally May. Running in fourth position is the first three. Kick on from the others. They've opened up eight lengths on the rest of the field already. And then it's first time in forever, followed by a ground-saving Mahina and an unhurried, precocious times. So on to the back stretch, three of them together and well clear of the others. Ropers and Wranglers has it by three quarters of a length. Tickle my fancy second, Rugelach to the outside is third. 22.81 was that opening quarter mile. Break of another seven lengths more. Back to Dally May, then first time in forever on the outside. Mahina is second last and precocious time still biding time. 12 lengths off the lead, 46.78 was the half mile. Ropers and Wranglers, a 50 to 1 long shot, leads the way on the far turn. Rugelach getting closer now on the outside, moves up alongside the front runner, Tickle My Fancy is third. And here come the others, too. First time in forever has closed the gap to four lengths and is closing on the outside. Mahina comes down the center. Dolly May is down toward the rail, and Precocious Times is coming now and coming quickly down the center of the course. Rugelach, the one to catch Precocious Times, running out of time, and it's going to be Rugelach to win it over Precocious Times. Then first time in forever, and Mahina. Number four, Rugelach was first. A photo for place. Hold all tickets. Final time, 135.14. Six precocious times second, five first time in forever third, two Mahina fourth. It's official, 4652. There are no changes in the upcoming fifth race, post time 230.
Returning to the winner's circle is Rugalak. Three-year-old dark bear brown filly by Twirling Pandy, out of Proud and Charming by Proud Citizen. Owned by Tony Sardo, trained by Ron Ellis, and ridden by Juan Hernandez. The winner was bred in Florida by CESA Farm. That's winner number two today for Juan Hernandez. 